yeah. as a team that made this possible. You can thank okay. you. Um, I think I really need to do this, and I'd like the people uh, to come forward as well. Um, so obviously, thank you to all of you for taking time out. Uh, you know, we all have busy schedules, weekends are where we get a breather. So thank you for coming. It's for all of us. Um, obviously, Sir Graham Brady has left, but uh, he took time out as well, so thank you for that. Mm -hmm. Thank you to the police representatives. Really, really appreciate you all coming here. It gives us that sense that, you know, we matter and, you know, you're there for us. Uh, and again, building that sort of community. Uh, and thank you to the councillors who are here uh, for coming and you know, giving us your insight into this. And of course, we'll take this forward. Um, and can I please call forward the admins of, who made this possible? A lot of people were involved. It's just not me. I can't take credit. Um, so Dr. Amir Hanan, could you please come forward? Um, put your hand up, sir, because I can't his hand. Oh, all right, okay. <laughs> put your hand up. You don't know. Uh, uh, Homa, what um, Eleanor, please. Um, Shanaz Avan and Ithikar Avan, they haven't been able to come. They had some guests over, but they helped in uh, getting Sir Graham Brady over here. Uh, Ghazala, oh, she had to go, but she's, she's actually, she started getting this venue organized. Uh, she sorted out, you know, she was our point of contact with the center. So, you know, the teas and the coffees and the approvals for the projector and the venue, everything was done by uh, Ghazala. Uh, Aisha, she's my neighbor, we went knocking door to door. <laughs> she was in the cold and he spoke and she's been taking notes and everything. Um, Dr. Umran Ali, he helped with the flyers and stuff, I think he's not here. And then you. Uh, well, I put my name because I didn't know who's doing this. But <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, uh, wonderful. have a little meeting and we will take actions from that and then we communicate it to everybody. I hope uh, you all consent for us to talk to each other. Uh, and we'll, whoever has consented, we'll add them to the community. WhatsApp is the easiest way of just quickly communicating. But formal mails with actions and timelines, we will send by email uh, because it will be too big for the WhatsApp. Can you let us know when you have those meetings and we'll make sure Okay. Excellent. Yes. Indeed. Can I make a suggestion? Because I've, I've been here before, <laughs> as you can see. <laughs> the first meeting is always well intended because there's great emotions behind it. But you've expressed those emotions, and what happens now is you're actually feeling good about yourself, <laughs> and it is it is very likely that you settle on these emotions and don't do much else. So. Please be aware, look, look inside yourself. Be aware that when you walk out a couple of weeks time, it's not, it doesn't mean as much in two weeks time as it did today. But that, that is the obstacle that we have to overcome as a community, is we can't just react when it meant something. We have to institute that meaning into this problem because its longevity depends on that. And we can't carry things through anger because the anger to some extent has been dissipated today. <coughs> so we, we need to get other feelings into ourselves to maintain this. Otherwise, I can assure you, within three or four weeks, this will be dead. All right? So we need to get, you know, keep that feeling going, not anger, but resilience, wanting to develop, etc. So can I just ask, just in terms of next steps, um, we are going to send an email out to everybody. Uh, as you can see, we've recorded the event because I know there's many people who would have liked to have been able to come here today and haven't been able to, so hopefully we can get the video out so people can watch. Um, I mentioned the booklet that we produced. It's the first step, it's the first first time we've done something like that to try and bring information together because there's a lot of information on various different websites, but it's difficult to go everywhere, so we've tried to bring information together. But we'd like your help to look at what you think, what we can add, and as I've been pointed out, I thought Cheshire Police was our local police, so <laughs> maybe we need to sort of look at what our local police officer is. That's what our local police officer is. <laughs> so fantastic. I mean, look at the watch clock there. It's one minute past four, and it's done brilliant. Thank you.